What's going on everybody? Let's come back and talk about this box. Alright, to uh, stay on the kind of the theme for getting ready for fishing with uh, Mid-10 Outdoors, I ordered one of these. Um, this is from Mystery Tackle Box. Uh, this is the Mystery Gift Box. I ordered it just to see what I could get. I also ordered a couple other things that's in here that I'll show you that was additional um, that was not part of the box itself. So anyway, uh, I think this was the $15 box for Mystery Tackle Box. Go in there and look for Mystery Gift Box. Then you can select the category that you want for your box. What I selected was bass because we have quite a bit of bass here at, just down the street from where I live. Uh, Old Hickory Lake has a really known for striped bass um, also has uh, pretty good size um, big mouth bass small bass cat it's got everything in it uh, let me bring up and I'll show this on camera my daughter this was a few years ago but that is a striped bass she caught fishing from the bank that was a big fish um, big fish so anyway, yeah, she caught that out of the lake right down the street from my house. Literally right down the street from the house. So let's get into the mystery box. Mystery box, I think is really cool. All right. They also have a thing on uh, their uh, website that says catch and win. Catch a fish, measure it using the box. I think you can see that ruler on there. Yep, you can see the ruler. Measure it and share it on social media um, with the hashtag of NTB Keeper. Uh, chance to win great prizes. So, we must do that over the summer or spring, winter, fall. Uh, this top part is not part of the mystery box. I ordered this part separate with the box. I ordered a sticker pack, but I really liked, I think that might go on the Titan. Me and Chase may have to fight over that one. Or that might go on the Titan. And then there's catch and release sticker. So what did come in here is the goods I'm fixing to pull out. Uh, we got a little frog. See that? We got a um, floating jig. Show you that right there. Good looking one. That'll come in handy here pretty soon. We got some Mismo worms, and we got some Charlie's worms, and we got a mysterytacklebox.com sticker, and of course a card that uh, tells you everything that's in it. Uh, yeah, tells you everything that's in it. Then it tells you to go to their website, you know, watch some how-tos on fishing. So anyway, I think it's a pretty cool little box. I was pretty jazzed when I got it. Um, see, keeper requirements. I didn't see this. Panfish has to be 6 inches. Trout has to be 12. Bass has to be 14. Walleye has to be 16. Everything else, 18. So I dare say that one henna caught that day uh, was definitely an 18-inch fish uh, striped bass. So we probably could have definitely got her into that category with that. But anyway, Mystery Tackle Box looks like it's a pretty cool deal. Uh, if you're feeling up to ordering one, go for it. I highly recommend it. Um, I may try a couple of the others before it's over with. Now, I don't get big into spending a bunch of money on these tech, you know, stuff like this, but I think it's a good deal. And um, if it's something that you know you're interested in, um, you know, go for it. You know, I. There's all kinds of these boxes out there that are pretty darn cool. Um, I got one of the man cans from Iraq Veteran 8888 a while back. It was really cool. I ordered it as a particular year or a particular month on purpose because I wanted it, uh, what it represented. But anyway, so go check out Mystery Tackle Box. If you like subscribing to that kind of stuff, go subscribe. I may buy another couple before it's over with. I like the bass ones. Um, I gotta go back and look and see what others they have options. 
But uh, the bass one I'll definitely use. Uh, if I got some panfish or something like that, I may order one of those, see what they got. But uh, anyway, that's it for now. It's Patrick Mitchell Outdoors. Get outdoors. I'm fixing to.